Um, the Park Real album is a rock and roll album, even though it's a jazz record. It has an outsider quality to it that I think has made it survive the age. And we're going to revive it and slap it silly until it starts competing again. It's going to happen right now.
Hi everyone, it's Elizabeth here. I'm really sorry I can't be there tonight. I'm actually um, shooting a film all, all last week and all next week and this weekend. Um, otherwise I would be there in a heartbeat. A uh, big thank you to everyone for coming and for making this happen, um, especially Paul Corby who spearheaded this. And I'm actually quite bashful about it um, that my album is being feted this way. Uh, it's a real honor for all of the musicians um, to be taking my tunes and and making them yours. So thank you for doing that and thank you for the care um, and uh, for what you do as musicians. Musician to musician, I love you. <laughs> so I am actually talking to you from my house in the woods here. This is my view. And um, this is where I live now, so it's far from Parkdale. Uh, but <laughs> it's, uh, it's a good way to be. Um, that was 10 years ago, and in those 10 years, I've seen Parkdale really change. Um, at the time that I wrote the songs for the album, I felt like I was going through a massive personal transition and saw that sort of reflected in the neighborhood around me. And uh, seen that more and more in all of Toronto as it's been gentrified. Um, and I guess what I loved about Parkdale was that there was always room for everyone. There was space for anyone, no matter how unhinged or how perfected and everything in between. Um, and that's the beauty of Parkdale still, I feel, is that there's space for everyone. And uh, unlike other neighborhoods, it hasn't squeezed everyone out for this sort of more homogenous Toronto. So yay Parkdale! Um, I think it's great that it's being held uh, back where the initial launch was held um, 10 years ago at the Gladstone. So hurrah, still going strong. I'm glad to see that uh, anyways, I don't want to take up more time. Thank you everyone. Sincerely, this this means a lot to me and it's very touching and I'm uh, I'm I'm blushing. <laughs> um, thank you Paul and uh, enjoy the night. Love you.